hello everyone welcome to our channel today i'll be showing you guys how to take a screenshot on your samsung galaxy watch active starting right now this will also work on the newer galaxy watch active 2 which i have pre-ordered already and i'm eagerly waiting for its delivery so hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any upcoming videos about it if you are someone new to our channel please consider subscribing to our channel as we do regular reviews for various smartwatches and smartphones software reviews tutorials and much more also check out our playlist tab to find curated playlist for various content we post on this channel we will find a playlist exclusively for galaxy watch active be sure to check it out Alright guys, yes you can take a screenshot of any app, game, watch face and pretty much anything on your Galaxy Watch Active or the newer Galaxy Watch Active 2. And I'm going to show you how to do that, few settings you should certainly know how to do that and how to transfer the taken screenshots to your phone. Let's talk about the important setting first before I show you how to screen capture. Scroll down from top of the screen to open the drop down tray, find settings in there, scroll down until you find the advanced settings wherein you should find screen capture. For any reason if this is turned off, you won't be able to take screenshots so make sure it's turned on unless you really don't want to take any screenshots. But here's what I would say, there is no way that you would accidentally keep taking screenshots and fill up your watch with it. So it would be harmless to keep it turned on all the time. Now let me show you how to take a screenshot. All you have to do is press the bottom right button and swipe on the screen from left to right simultaneously. If you don't coordinate both of these tasks together, you won't be able to take a screenshot and that is why in the first place I say that you won't be accidentally taking screenshots as it is not that easy. Now it's easier to take a screenshot when the watch is not on your wrist uh, as you can use both your hands as you can see right in here. But it is harder to take a screenshot when the watch is on your wrist. But don't you worry, I got you covered. I will now show you a trick um, that will work single handedly in fractions of a second. Now, once the watch is on your wrist, use your thumb to place the uh, to press the button. Use your middle finger to stabilize the watch by keeping it diagonally opposite to your thumb so that you can use your index finger to swipe along on the screen. Let me show you how. Now this technique works for me. I have tried other finger placements and for me it does not work sometimes. So let me know in the comments down below which technique works for you the best. I would love to hear from you guys. Now let me show you that this feature will work on any apps. Um, let me show you with games and the other apps. Alright now the question is where would you find all the taken screenshots and the answer to it is in the gallery. So let's go in the gallery. So here are all the screenshots that we took. Now to delete the unwanted screenshots tap hold on any image and you will get options to start selecting the images. Once done, click on the delete button and you'll be prompted to make sure to delete the selected images and they are done. Now in case if you want to send the screenshots on your smartphone, do the same to select multiple images and click the three dots on the right side of the screen for the option to send them on the phone right from your watch. Let me show you the screenshots on my smartphone. So the screenshots are 
.png that is portable network graphic files uh, of 360 by 360 resolution which is the screen resolution of the watch itself but since it's png file the background is transparent at the corners um, as shown in this screenshot so it's really easy to use these shots in Photoshop for editing if that's what your goal is or you can use them as a sticker to place it on top of any image since the background is already transparent. So there it is. It's really easy to take a screenshot on Galaxy Watch Active. I came from Fitbit Versa where this feature is still not available even on the newer Fitbit Versa 2. So I can really appreciate Samsung for to provide a built-in screen capture feature so you can take the screenshots without installing any third-party application. Guys, if you're looking for great deals on Galaxy Watch Active and its accessories, make sure to check out our Amazon storefront in the description of this video where you'll find a link to try Amazon Prime for absolutely no charge. Be sure to check it out. So I really hope you found this video helpful. If you did, then please give this video a thumbs up and maybe give it a thumbs up anyways as an appreciation to our effort for making this video. It really means a lot. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos and take care. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.